What is going on guys? My name is Fusions and today we're going to be opening up this Bakugan Diogan Rising RLS Sharktar Ultra. So let's open it up guys. So today we're going to be opening up a Bakugan Ultra. This is RLS Sharktar Ultra but before we get into this Bakugan we're going to open up a Bakugan booster pack. We still have this card collection that I opened up a couple or few videos ago and uh yeah, we got two packs in here, so we're going to take out one of these and open one of them. I'm also going to show you what comes inside this uh, card collection. So it comes with three packs, two Baku cores, and then the Nelius Ultra like jumbo card. I'm going to show you the cores, just in case if you want to get this um, card collection, you see what cores it comes with. Because I'm pretty sure all the Nelius ones come with these cores specifically. So we got two shields. Minus 400 and plus 400 for Aquas and Darkest. So it's actually nice. One of the one of the cores is actually pretty good. And then we have the two packs, which I'm just going to open one in this video. And then the other one I'm probably going to open up in another video. So yeah, that's what I use these for for every uh, video. So let's open up this um, Battle Brawlers booster pack, which is the base set of Bakugan Battle Planet. Let's open this pack and let's hope we get a Mac. That's going to be the new catchphrase. For opening up uh, battle brawlers light break counter pyrus lights courage pretty good card wither exhilarate seize outsiders titan halcourt ultra we got diamond fangzor shun kazami okay we got an awesomer and this one's actually a nice one his shun it's pretty good and then for the hex we have wing cutter which is a rare hex and it looks awesome just like any other hex they look awesome but now let's open up this Bakugan, this RLS Shark Tart Ultra. Let's look at the back of this box. Here is the wave that it comes in. It comes in this uh, wave here. Uh, I think I've opened all of them except the Diamond Pentator. I have not found that yet. Um, and I think the rest I have opened already. Except the uh, Pyrus Fenica. I already said that, that I do not want to get that one because I already have it. So yeah, um, we have a character card, action card gate card and two baku cores let's open this up and let's see uh let's see this bakugan let's see this bakugan ultra first like always we're gonna take out uh, the little bag that's over here there we go and let's see what's inside this uh, little bag let's take out everything here all righty first let's take a look at the core so it looks like we got a green fist and oh okay we got a magic shield I thought it was going to be a double green fist. So we got a magic shield, which is going to give us plus 600 B, the second best magic shield. The best one is 650. Um, so this is second best. And then we have a plus two damage or attack for this green fist. I don't like the green fist. All right. So what else do we have in here? So we have this uh, how to play guide here, which we do not need. Did we get a list like we always do? Yes, we did. We got a, the instructions to how to close the shark tar, which I'm going to show you guys. And then we have a small list of the Bakugan, Geogan, and uh, Bakugan Ultras uh, here. So, so now let's take a look at the cards that come in here. First, the gate card. We have a Lupithion. Okay, I don't see this gate card that often, so that's actually pretty nice. Awesome. Gate card number 20 in the set. We have an action card, which is Blinding Aquabite. It is not a common one. I don't remember seeing this one too much. Two energy, plus four damage, and two frost strike. So that's awesome. For two energy, that might actually be pretty good. Aquas and Chaos card. And then for the stats of this Arliss Shark Tar Ultra, we have, let's see, here it is. We got the Magic Shield, Green Fist, 500 B power, two attack. But it does have an ability if you do land on a Magic Shield, you get plus 200 B and two attack. So let's say you land on the best magic shield, which is plus 650 B with all this and the ability, uh, you will be at 1350, if I'm not mistaken, with four attack, which is actually not bad. It is for an RLS. Uh, my standards have lowered now because I know that RLS are supposed to be super strong, but they not, not in the TCG or not in the, in Bakugan, um, in the card game they they just i don't know i don't know what's happening the rls bakugan are not as strong as they should be but this one is all right i would say like i said you land on a magic shield uh you get to 1350 with four attack it's actually a decent rls believe it or not and now let's take a look at the bakugan itself here it is rls shark tart ultra 
very very nice uh, already looks pretty cool and look at that damn my boy Shartar got some grills there look at that Ooh, all silver on his mouth we got some nice grills so yeah looking pretty fresh i would say nice i like the rls colors on this bakugan it makes it look pretty cool not gonna lie but i think other factions might look better uh maybe i mean the original you know aquas would look pretty cool but this one looks like it looks fresh it, it definitely looks fresh it's a it's a cool bakugan i don't know if i like the ultra more than the core but this is still a pretty cool bakugan so now how do we close this bakugan so first we're gonna put the head down then the arms up make sure you hold everything with one hand like that then we're gonna put one of the feet up and then the other one and then hold everything still like that then we're gonna uh, lock it up and close it with the tail and we're gonna put this up and make sure these two go inside that little hole there there we go so it locks everything good and then finish it with this last part and that is how you close this shark tart ultra it is uh, a lot it has a lot of parts um but it's actually not too difficult to close and uh it looks pretty cool now let's open it up it is an ultra so that's why it has like all these uh parts and it's kind of complex and because it is an ultra it's gonna do some sort of movement let's see if it could do a jump for us three two one draw and it tried doing a jump but it hit the wall it is supposed to jump forward like that do a little flip and land like that all right guys so what did you guys think of this rls shark tart ultra bakugan i think it looks nice i really like that the shark has some grills there looks pretty cool pretty fresh and then the stats are not too bad for an rls bakugan uh obviously i expect a lot more from rls but i'm i'm happy with this one that's all i can say it's it's all right it's pretty good but let me know in the comments uh, what you guys think of this Bakugan. Make sure to hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe and stay tuned for more Bakugan content. Thank you guys for all the support you guys have been given to the channel. Seriously, thank you guys. Thanks for watching guys and peace out.